that whole meme about uh, AI generated entertainment. Uh, who's it? Computer generated ent entertainment. Is it all very old a video? Here we go. Veggie Tales predicts modern internet humor. This is the one. Um, let's see if we can play this. Um, where you've probably heard this, if it, but you know, we're gonna, we're gonna play it anyway, just because why the fuck not? We're already playing stuff today anyway, might as well. In the future, entertainment will be randomly generated. Randomly generated? Randomly generated. What better way to achieve the unexpected? I've seen the future, Bob, and I'll the future ahead to hosts that. of the future. Unlike us, their humor can be truly randomly generated. Right, guys? Why did the chicken cross the road? I don't know. Why did the chicken cross the road? Weed eater. Now that's funny. That doesn't make any sense. It's funny because it's unexpected. Well, exactly. well whatever happened to it's <clears throat> funny because it's true. Two plus two equals four is true, but not funny. Mm -hmm. Guys? What is the solution to the equation 2 plus 2? I don't know. What does 2 plus 2 equal? Weed eater. <laughs> Weed eater. Like, this is a joke, but this isn't even, like, that crazy of an idea. There are already multiple, like, AI streamers out there. Actually, you know what? We'll show another one. There are multiple AI streamers out there already doing exactly this. Like, my favorite, uh, Neurosummer. This is... This is an AI VTuber that interacts with chat and actually responds generally in a coherent manner. A lot of the time it's a mess, but... L, <clears throat> L is a letter. I don't know why I said that. Are there any other letters you want me to try saying? I guess I have a lot of L fans. I'll see what I can do. W. 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 Mm -hmm. If you all say W at the same time, I'll think it's funny. You guys said W. Haha, ah, that was pretty funny. Thanks. And now it breaks. And W. There w we go. W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W W This was sort of actually we'll keep going. RGH. There you go. So Neurosummer was sort of the This was what started this new trend of like AI generated stream content. Neurosummer got a lot of attention when uh when she first started <clears throat> and then we started seeing a lot of other stuff you had obviously the athene stuff i just showed you but there's also this uh this ai seinfeld it's it's not good okay so this ended up getting banned uh <laughs> because it made a uh i i don't know if no, i can read the joke um it made a a joke about uh transgender and mental illness and uh yeah twitch was not too happy about it and also <laughs> saying liberals are secretly gay so that got it banned at least temporarily which is probably going to come back but you obviously have to you have to at least temporarily ban these systems if they break the rules even if you know even if it's not as bad as someone actively doing. Like, if if someone goes out of their way to, to like, actually say this joke themselves, that's a bit different from it being generated by a system. Or, like, <clears throat> in the case of Neurosummer, who has uh, said some things about certain events in World War II. Um, yeah, it's a little bit different than, like, a human going and saying it but like okay i'm not gonna say that this is good right but there is some entertainment value that actually comes from 
this AI Seinfeld. I'm going to give you a brief look at it. We're not going to watch the entire thing because it's like, this is five minutes long. Uh, let's just hear what AI Seinfeld was actually like. Hey, Yvonne. Did you hear about that new restaurant around the corner? <laughs> it gets the, the whole laugh at the wrong, like, just have the laugh track going at the entirely wrong point perfectly. <laughs> have the laugh track on the setup, not the joke. <laughs> They're supposed to have the best food in town. I heard they just opened up and I'm dying to try it. But For anyone just listening, uh, it also generates the visuals, and the visuals are probably the worst part that it generates. It looks so expensive. Maybe we can make a deal with the owner, you know, trade them some of our jokes for a free meal? What do you think, Larry? I mean, it's either that, or we mooch off our friends again. That's a great idea. We'd be like comedians <laughs> for hire. What's he doing? <laughs> Fine. We'll skip ahead to, to one of the, the stage bits, because this is where, like, it actually tries to make a joke, and some of the jokes are jokes, which is surprising. <laughs> oh, no, this is the best part. So, when it has, like, the final line of a segment, it has this really weird, awkward silence, like, almost every time. <laughs> Here's hoping the owner is a fan of our humor. And now we just wait. Nothing happens for like five seconds. And then... It just I hate cuts. it when people say, it's not the size that matters, it's how you use it. What am I supposed to do with that? Like, that's not a good joke, but it's a joke. Like, that is structured as if it's humor it's the sort of joke a five-year-old like would tell you when they first learn about dick jokes maybe like a seven-year-old when they first learn about dick jokes but it's like actually a joke it, like the, the idea of weed eater is not even like a crazy idea like <laughs> there is going to be a point in the future where ai entertainment is legitimately a part of the discussion.